we are in the car and we're on the way to our family vacation. We're going to Moon Palace in Cancun, Mexico. And Grams is flying there from England to meet us. It's going to be so much fun. We came here. We came here about a year and a half ago for spring break, and spring break is a crazy busy time. So, hoping it'll be a little bit less busy. But Philip hasn't been, and the amenities are incredible. It's incredible for kids. It's got the most incredible gym. The food is amazing because I know people are a bit like mm, the all inclusive food. This food is so good. So, we're so excited. We're going on vacation. We're going on vacation. Philip thought that I'd pack something. <laughs> He's the one in trouble, not me. And we got through security. We got Harry. This is Harry's foot, by the way, because his foot came off. So here's Harry. This is the state of Harry. My mom's about to sew him when we get to Mexico. The, the head's about to come off. His foot's already off. But we love Harry's foot, don't we? So we managed to board the plane and someone got their little surprise present. I thought a transformer would be a good idea because it can be a car or a transformer. So we're gonna have lots of fun with that. So the flight was a little bit delayed and then the baggage has taken two hours, something crazy like that. There was nowhere to sit. And again, thank goodness for the tablet. We've got a little audio book going on and it saved the day. A little setup. So yeah, we're waiting on the car. My mom is at a different terminal getting stressed. Yeah, she's over there. We're here. Hopefully we find her and hopefully we feed this man because he's not eating all day. Luckily we're going to an all-inclusive hotel because I know that's the first place he's going is for food. We found her. Okay, she's so excited. Let's go! Did you know it was me? Ooh. Oh my goodness, Alpha Milo's. Ooh. Ooh. Oh, I love you. went to the room that was so sweet that they did the little affirmations from our kind of like baby reveal video that was the most thoughtful thing ever even though i have a balloon phobia maybe you didn't know that fun fact they're up high they're helium ones so that was okay <laughs> but i'm also glad we're gonna leave them in the room that my son and my mom are gonna be in potentially but he's already said he's sleeping in our bed still so so much for a restful night's sleep but me and philip are gonna go on solo to the buffet and go eat and make up for a long travel day of not eating and they're gonna get room service because he is pooped so yeah let's go find out what this buffet is all about so we went to the buffet weren't really feeling it so now we've come to the italian restaurant and you know when you get food from her when someone else orders it on this table they've got that like pasta cheese bowl thing i've never had it in my whole life and always wanted it and i'm like which pasta is this it's so creamy and cheesy and delicious Fun morning so we basically went to the buffet then we ended up at that italian place and then we ate so much that we just came straight to bed yeah, and got the, a good night rest what well, i did yes. yeah i woke up every time that the ac switch it off could switch it off because usually i have white noise on that's consistent but i couldn't find the phone charger i didn't bother charging my phone and then i knew my phone would die if i put the white noise on so anyway and then someone banged on our door at 4 a.m of course i heard it philip didn't my mom heard it too but now we're actually headed off for a little workout and then we're gonna go and get breakfast but our son has already gone with my mom to breakfast so they can hit the beach early and then hopefully she's gonna bring him back for a nap in the heat of the day but we will see how that goes <laughs> we had a really good workout then we went and got the smoothies we went and got breakfast and now we are dressed to go and find our little man at the beach and my mom they are having the time of their lives building sandcastles so yeah really excited i just tried this crazy sunscreen which is like honestly goes on like whipped cream it's the wildest thing ever and it was a lot i'm gonna definitely put it in a little get ready with me video on Instagram and all the links to this outfit too so you can go find that post if you like what I'm wearing someone has built a whole water park look at this flags wind turbines for energy he's going off with daddy look at that sandy butt We just had a really delicious dinner. 
at one of the restaurants called Moma in the other hotel, the one that we stayed at the first time. And now I'm getting a Nutella crate. Nutella is my favorite. I'm getting a Nutella crate for dessert and I cannot wait. About to work out. We had a very good night's sleep. We've been tracking our sleep. I wear my ring, he wears his watch. We've been getting at least eight hours. So I feel like that's true vacation. We feel really, really good. And so today, yeah, we're gonna work out again, have breakfast, have to sort some reservation stuff out, and then we're going back to the beach, back to the water park. Yeah, it's a good time. We are on our way to the water park. Yay! food out really quick and also this all of the restaurants at the hotel have this like really cute little place to put your bags next to you which is so nice food has just arrived we got mac and cheese we got white chocolate red pudding the love is inside oh yeah daddy's happy about this We just got back from the most yummy dinner. We went to the steak restaurant and we're about to be in bed for 8.30 p.m. We're on vacation. When you get to the age where getting into bed at 8.30 is like the best form of vacation, you're winning. So processing. I'm gonna show you the little videos. It was so funny because I have this light. Let me show you this light and um, so most places are kind of dark it's really good to make your videos just have better quality because there's more light they're just better and it was funny because i got the light out to film the food and they were laughing at me on the table next to us i was like if only you knew though that it's my job i'm not just like if i wasn't i don't know if it wasn't part of my life i wouldn't take photos of food if that makes sense but also that's okay too food is amazing so Ah, best night ever. That was so good. Oh, yeah. This is such a good vacation. So this morning, we are going to a little breakfast at the circus restaurant. So, I don't know, we will see. I've got to take this hat off now, I'm sorry. I look a little bit ridiculous. But yeah, we're going for a little breakfast. We're going to wait here till the table's ready, I guess. Excited. Good morning. So we've had a very wet night here in Cancun. And as you can see, we left clothes out and they are absolutely soaked. Soak and soak. Can you see we're also steaming up the phone a little bit? But yeah, poor Philip. Well, it's not your whole wardrobe. You're exaggerating a little bit. I see one top and one pair of shorts. Oh, wow, that's so steamy. And we're about to go for a steamy breakfast. The room at this point, I don't know what we're doing here. Gotten very comfortable, I guess. I don't know if I ever showed you, but they got me the most beautiful flowers. Look how beautiful the flowers are that they put in our room. It's a little behind the scenes of what breakfast looks like. All of the different restaurants have a little kids activity. Obviously, as much fresh fruit as we can eat. We're having a little omelette. We've got fresh juices made. And yeah, this restaurant is our favorite for breakfast because it's absolutely empty and it's 9 a.m. Tell me a hotel that has an empty breakfast at 9 a.m. I don't know who else has baby hairs like this, but mine just will not behave in this humidity and heat. We are back at the water park and then you see them. 
They're running up over there. And me and baby girl are about to just sit and chill. It's nice and cloudy, but that does not mean I won't get sunburn. I will probably get sunburn. On the way to dinner with my dinner date. Someone's wearing a very cool Lakers fit tonight. Picked it out and dressed himself. Swag and swag stuff. With Harry, of course. Daddy's in the front, looking handsome. Oh, I bought him that t-shirt. Can I have that? That's spicy though. Good morning, Philip Payne. <laughs> Vacation vibes. We... <laughs> Okay. I was, I was making a salt hair video of my essentials. Obviously, we got our dry shampoo, our body mist, our all in one heat protectant, serum DO, lip oil balms, and then a very secret, top secret, unreleased product that we don't know when we're going to launch, but I cannot stop wearing it. The most perfect. Anyway, can't say. So, yeah, we are. Uh, I'm doing not the best job of vlogging. I find it really hard on vacation, especially this vacation that no content creators or in influencers are around. No one is taking photos. I've not seen, I've seen maybe like two people take a photo in a public area. Like it's just not the vibes. So I've just been struggling to get the camera out and like at dinner, I literally the other night, the table next to me was laughing because I got my light out. If only they knew. But anyway, yeah, let's be honest. It can feel a little bit embarrassing sometimes whipping the phone out, especially in an environment where like people are judgy or giving you the eyes and they're just trying to have vacation and it makes them feel uncomfortable. I'm not uncomfortable doing it, but I know it's making them feel uncomfortable so then I don't want to make them feel uncomfortable if that makes sense. Anyway we're off to the beach and off to the pool today. Got a little warm-up fit. Look at this state of this. Oh my gosh this room is a disaster. But yeah we're in a little Walmart swimsuit and I'm obsessed with this sarong. So many sarongs are short and this one is so long even with me being five foot nine. And yeah we're headed off. I'm trying to do some content with my mom today so we'll see how that goes. I think I'm gonna take a tripod to a beach so we'll see. Breakfast with us. It is the most amazing buffet. I'm going to show you all the little different stations. Start over here. They've got loads of different nuts and seeds. They got chia seeds, granola. They've got cereals. My son always eats the Rice Krispies. They've got all of these amazing fresh juices here. And then basically, I usually make like a yogurt concoction, and then I add mango, strawberry Kool-Aid, and then my chia seeds. And they also have some special like local soups in there. And then of course, an amazing fruit spread. Getting this fruit on. Pastries again, this is like the busiest time. We usually come a little bit earlier. So a lot of things have been eaten, but there's salmon, lots of different cheeses, bread stations, and then of course an omelette station, which is so good. There's so many different omelette toppings. I got a delicious omelette yesterday. I haven't eaten any of this yet, but I did have the carrots yesterday. They were yummy. Sausages, bacon, this is Philip's favorite area with the French toast and the pancakes. And make your own smoothies as well, so you can choose like the base, what you want in it. circus restaurant and there is the most insane dessert buffet I've ever seen like a kid's actual dream an adult's dream my dream <laughs> but look at this little donut wall like a little teaser right you're like oh how cute there's a few donuts wait till you see this like Oreos candy apples donuts churro mousse things whatever this chocolate thing is strawberry milkshake mousse more more and then there's a whole magic ice cream where I guess you get to make your own ice cream and then look at the design of this restaurant isn't it magical so cute for kids has some of the best pizza we've ever had. Wow, because I've been to Italy. It's, you know, I'm not. Pizza in Italy is amazing too, of course, but this was shockingly good that we're in Mexico in Cancun and they have this level of amazing pizza. It's the type of pizza where the crust is so good, you eat the whole crust. The dough is so good. Like I've lived 33 years without trying the pasta in the cheese bowl and today that's about to change so we're very excited. Mm. Oh wow! Yeah, creamy. 
is our last night here in Cancun. And one thing that was crazy we just realized was that we've not had to wear bug spray once. We have not had to apply bug spray because they fumigate the resort so, so well. So oh, that's wow. actually a huge bonus because I hate putting on bug spray at night. Like you shower, after your day at the beach, whatever, get ready for a nice dinner. The last thing you want to do is spray bug spray and then smell of bug spray. So that's been actually really, really nice on this vacation. And I'm out of room, I'm out of breath. Lots of food, lots of baby. And we're finally back in our lovely little building 87. About to go to bed for the final time here. We'll be very sad to leave tomorrow. Just wish the vacation was longer. <laughs> we are basically all packed up and ready to go. Well, I wouldn't say ready because we actually don't want to leave. We wish you had another couple days here. But yeah, suitcase packed. I'm um, umming and ahhing because my mom and our little man are at all. If I know they're probably only gonna be there for like another 30 minutes, so I don't know if it's worth going where showering again and doing all that. But I feel sad because I hate missing out on like the last little minutes of vacation. I also popped a nail off when I was packing. That's why I love press on nails though, because if they would have been acrylics or anything like that, they would have like smashed and hurt my nails. So press on for the win. But yeah, we're flying back to Austin, flying southwest back again. I'm gonna not do the extra 150 dollar upgrade thing and just we're still group a because i got early bird check-in but i don't know what that means for where we're going to sit yeah this has been the most amazing stay hope you've loved following our little family on our mexico moon palace vacation and let me know if you have any questions about the resort here they have this membership thing we're not sure if you want to do it yet because i do love traveling to all different parts of the world but they do have hotels all around the world so something to consider but thank you for watching see you on the next video bye